Ah yes, back to the countryside. Rolling hills, mountains, fresh air, and bumpy roads. You want me to drive? Really bumpy roads. But I'm always willing to brave a little turbulence for some interesting food. I'm on my way to visit my cousin Silvana and her husband Onofrio near the Sancho Padello countryside. They have been growing ancient heirloom grains on their farm, and I'm anxious to see what they're up to. I assumed this would be a casual event. That's them waiting for us. But when we arrived, we realized they had gone all out. They got pine nuts, raisins. Uh, they cooked that all together. That's their sauce. Even my mom and dad were there waiting for me. But of course, this is Sicily, and perfection is not a lasting state. Strong winds starting to blow down the tent. Spinning on <laughs> They make it. Right, it's better than nothing. Here's a fun fact. Salt is a crucial part of Sicilian cuisine. So we put it the second. He found salt. A reason to celebrate. So with all this happening, it was time to learn about these grains. They're growing grains like Tumania and Faro, as well as beans like black chickpea. So the biggest thing is when it's all organic, is when you pick this stuff, there's a process, so the weight of it diminishes with each process that they go through. This all got started because of Onofrio. He and Savannah wanted to reintroduce people to these classics. Onofrio is the ideas guy, and Savannah is the one that makes them happen. So him and his family, his friends, they, they're, they're hard workers. They, they have a lot of land to work. They want to keep doing this. It's just the hardest part is finding a place to sell all this stuff. You know, time passes at a slower pace in the countryside. He'll go back about four times and pull that up. <laughs> this one. And the racing, racing. Good, very good. Especially when I'm arguing with my dad about olive oil. All the oil from Spain is a very light oil. Okay. This is my experience. Okay. You can take it whatever you want to take. Okay. Okay. All right. That's all I can tell you. <laughs> No problem. I cannot argue with him. No, you cannot <laughs> argue with me because that's what I know. Now, you know different, that's okay. He started Detalia in 1984 and still has a vested interest in what I'm doing. He's always giving me advice. I knew what I wanted. Most of the time I wanted stuff from Sizzler because that was a better taste for me. What else you want to know? Long walk. You know, Sicily in particularly is kind of in my heart, in my soul. It's part of my my history. Even though I wasn't born here, I feel such a connection. I mean, <laughs> you, just, you can just look at the the land. Look at look at the landscape. How beautiful it is. And it's a shame that they they don't have anywhere that they can really get this product to market. I think we can start bringing in some of these products for him, even if it's just a pallet or two. If we can get some people that are interested in it, but we have to be able to tell the story. 